So this is another Tech Tuesday video. So Tech Tuesdays are when I talk about the latest gadget, latest tech, the latest services you can use so you can make a better purchase decision. So without wasting much of your time, lights, mic, action. So I'm going to talk about MacBook Pro 16-inch 2021. Currently have the MacBook Pro 16-inch 2019 when it came out. And we've been waiting for two years for Apple to release the next generation MacBook Pro 16-inch. And it seems like finally they're going to release it around June this year, 2021. So I'm going to be telling you guys these five new features coming with the latest 16-inch MacBook Pros in 2021, which I'm very excited for because I can't just wait to get my hands on it. I can't wait for July to come. Just up release this product, man. Let's get started. So the first new feature you should expect in the MacBook Pro 16-inch is that it comes with slimmer bezels. The old generation 16-inch MacBook Pro has thick bezels. So getting slimmer bezels, it just makes the laptop going to look sexy. And you're going to get more immersive feelings out of it when you're watching a movie, when you're doing your work, color correcting, you're looking at colors, everything just probably going to pop. So moving on to the next feature, the MacBook Pro 16-inch is going to come with Apple's new mini LED display. We just are going to get brighter colors, more colorful, more colors in your face. They're just going to pop in your face and it's just going to make the experience a whole lot better. Apple already has retina. Just imagine how the mini LED display is going to look like. It's going to be fantastic. It's going to be mad. I am literally, I can't wait. I'm just, I'm just containing my excitement right here. The two new thing coming to the 16 in Mango Pro is that there's no touch bar. So bye bye to touch bar, bye bye. Touch bar is gone, it's going to be replaced with the function keys. I've actually never used any Magu Pros with function keys before, so I'm excited to see how that looks and how that works in total. The touch ID is going to stay intact, it's going to stay at the top right corner so you can unlock your Magu Pro with your finger. So the touch ID button still stays, the touch bar is gone, it's being replaced with function keys, okay? The fourth feature coming to the 16-inch MacBook Pro is that it comes with Apple's new M2 chip. This M2 chip is popularly known as M1X and when doing, when doing the speed comparison and when I check a lot of videos online, like the speed difference between the old one and the new one is just going to be mind-blowing, like you can never even compare. So there's no need to compare because the M2 chip outperforms the old generation, outperforms anything Apple have done before, so this is a must-have, this is a very very important new feature coming to the 16 inch mango pro and then finally and then finally the fifth feature coming to the 16 inch mango pro is that it's going to come with max safe charger which is going to be awesome i can't wait to get my hands on the 16 inch mango pro so i can finally use the max safe charger so when is the mango pro 16 inch going to be released according to some sources it says that july 2021 so stay tuned do not purchase any old generation mango pro 16 inch just have a little patience because in a month or two or three months at the highest, they're going to get the latest 16-inch MacBook Pro with the M1X chip, which is going to be Apple's best, most powerful MacBook Pro laptop ever created. So guys, just hold on until it's released. Talking about the price, the MacBook Pro 16-inch is going to come at about $2,400. This is just a premium price for a premium device. So. It's a lot of investment to go into and when i bought my macbook pro 16 inch up to now i've used it for more than one year i can say that it's the most powerful system i've used because it's even more powerful than my custom built pc i'm not just saying that to throw shades and to say apple versus windows i'm just saying that because of how useful my macbook pro 16 inch laptops have been that helped me do a lot of things a lot of projects i'll be able to complete faster and better because I'm using the Mango Pro 16 inch. I'm always able to work faster, complete projects faster, and deliver and always be productive thanks to the Mango Pro 16 inch. What are my honest thoughts concerning the 16 inch Mango Pro? My honest thought is that I honestly cannot wait. Once it is released, I'm selling my old Mango Pro 16 inch and I'm getting the Mango Pro 16 inch. That's all. That's what I'm going to say. It is a must have. You should get it that's my honest opinion because i've used it so i can personally guarantee that getting the 16 inch macbook pro is going to do wonders so going on to the final question should you buy the 16 inch macbook pro i'm going to say a strong yes yes 
buy the 16 inch MacBook Pro. So guys, thanks for watching my video. Remember, this is Tech Tuesday. So every Tuesday, I drop tech videos just like this one. So if you like that, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment below, and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on the next Tech Tuesday video. So guys, thank you for watching my video. I'm going to see you in my next video. Peace.